In this video, we will learn how to decide where to post transactions in the CRJ or the CPJ. The CRJ records every time the business receives cash from sales, customers or the owner. We can say all transactions where money is received will be recorded in the CRJ. The CPJ on the other hand is used when the business pays money like for rent, wages or buying goods. We use the CPJ when money goes out of the business. Let's look at a few transactions and decide whether it should be recorded in the CRJ or the CPJ. First, the owner deposits 20,000 Rand. In this case, the business receives money. Therefore, it will be recorded in the CRJ. In the second transaction, 3,000 Rand is paid by EFT for electricity. In this case, money goes out of the business and therefore this will be recorded in the CPJ. In the third transaction, the business gets 5,000 Rand from a customer. Money therefore comes into the business and therefore will be recorded in the CRJ. And lastly, a telephone bill for 800 Rand is paid via EFT. This is money leaving the business and therefore it will be recorded in the CPJ. Always remember if money comes into the business then we use the CRJ but if money goes out we use the CPJ. And that's a wrap on today's fascinating journey through the world of knowledge. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join our ever-growing community of curious minds. We can't wait to embark on new educational adventures together.